Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. And today we are going to be talking about one of my favourite brands, perfect for gifting, perfect probably for this time of year, actually. If you know somebody who's actually really into their hair, into their styling, whether it be for a man or a woman, Molten Brown. And I have to admit, Molten Brown is the absolute favourite product of mine. Um, it's, it is a high-end product, it is a high-end brand, um, and there is, of course, there's a certain nostalgia, there's a certain sort of feel to the product range, um, and you really do get the sense of that you're giving luxury when you buy Molten Brown and you and you give this to somebody. Um, always around Christmas time, my birthday, that type of thing, I always receive Molten Brown. Now this is really, really strange because I have, which you can probably imagine from watching my channel, I have a lot of hair products, a lot of shampoos, a lot of conditioners, sprays, you name it, I've got loads of it because I do on my channel. But the thing is, because I live in a busy household, um, and actually, I'm going to tell you I'll tell you something which I've not mentioned on my channel at all before. I am not trained and I am not taking this skill away from absolutely anybody at all because it is not easy. And I've taught myself over a long period of time, but I actually cut my twin brother's hair. And I'm not going to mention who else. There's a couple of other members of my family who I cut their hair as well. Um, so that is a really good skill to have. I don't do my own. I wish I could do my own. But of course, seeing the back of your head is really, really, really difficult. Um, so, so this was given to me as a gift, okay, and um, as you can imagine, the amount of products I've got, what I was saying, is I go through a lot, so I get to use that when I cut their hair and they use different products, and I say, have you tried this, have you tried that, so I usually end up getting through quite a lot of different products, but this particular uh, three products we're going to be looking at today, and all three of them were given to me as a gift, among other gifts, a long time ago, and you know, I feel awful saying this, but this was actually bought as a Christmas gift to me last year. And you know she you put things away and then they just slip out of your mind. Well, I was sorting some things out for this Christmas, wrapping gifts and things. I came across an area of, um, it was it was a large cupboard drawer, and when I looked in the back of it, it had all these different products which I got, which I got, which I received as gifts last year. And I thought actually halfway through this summer, I thought that, I, I can't remember using that. Um, I, and I wonder where that went. And actually I found it, can you believe it? I found it in November. Um, so of course we're now in December and I've been using this for a couple of weeks. Um, and I really, really like it. And at first I will be honest, it wasn't, Molten Brown shampoo and conditioner wasn't going to be something I would cover on my channel because of the sheer cost of the item. Now let's have a look at these products. So anybody who knows me knows that I really like thickening products and volumizing products and then sort of the conditioners to look after your hair after that. So I have got two and I'm just because I have started using them so you can just see the brands and the packaging and the colors of them. I have got two shampoos today. I've got a thickening shampoo and I've got a volumizing shampoo. Now you may think what's the difference? So straight off thickening is always going to help concentrate, lift that hair away from the scalp but it's going to help plump the hair out. So if you imagine a sponge, if you use anything what's thickening, it's really going to try and expand that cuticle, expand that hair. So you get much more of a feel of texture in the hair, much, much more of a feel of fullness and ultimately giving you that feeling of thicker hair. Now, ultimately, this happens very often in the roots. Um, and of course, playing with the right sort of passing and how you style your hair, a thickening shampoo can certainly make the difference of a very full bodied style, whether you're a man or a woman. Um, and to uh, make a huge difference compared to a full-bodied style and an ultra-fine sort of flat hairstyle, which of course is fine if you're going for that, but a thickening product certainly does that. Um, and Molten Brown certainly is really, really good for that. Um, the opposite one which I also have here is volumizing. Again, you may think, what's the difference? Wouldn't you just buy one? So volumizing will concentrate on, if you imagine thickening, uh, I always find that it, it, you have that, that cumulative, Let's try and speak again. So that uh, that build up effect. I can't even speak. I was trying to say cumulative effect. So, <laughs> so it will build up. So when you use a thickening shampoo, it usually sort of over time, it will sort of work for you. And the more you use it, sort of uh, you would hope that you wouldn't get a build up on there. And you certainly don't with these Morton Brown products. But thickening products usually tend to sort of cling to the hair and sort of make the hair appear fuller the more you use the range. That's what I'm trying to say. Now, volumizing. This is sort of more like your one day hair, your one day sort of style, and it will lift the whole of the hair. It will lift the hair away from the scalp and it will do its best at making the hair feel fuller. Heat usually makes a volumizing product sort of come awake and then it will give you that ultimate volume what you're looking for. It can just actually help you make your, your styling of your hair a lot more easier. Now, then lastly, we're going to be looking at a conditioner. I'm just going to shake the bottle because 
and then you can see it. So this one here, as you can see, really classic, really timeless, really, really nice, luxury, sophisticated packaging here. So perfect for gifts. Now, if I was given these a gift, I always put them in sort of gift bags, crepe paper, tissue paper, that type of thing. And because of the cost, which is, I did hesitate to put this on my channel because I really, I think there's enough on YouTube that these real overly expensive products. And you know what? I will speak from uh, experience that absolutely sometimes paying the world for a product colossal amount does not mean it will make your hair the most amazing standout hairstyle at all from what you can sometimes pay on the high street and supermarkets and stores wherever for a small amount sometimes you get just the same result so molten brown is a lot more expensive um but i feel that because it has the royal warrant for the product of uh molten brown they have such a uh, sort of a a world-renowned class of product and everything which goes into there you can just feel the luxury as soon as you start to use it you can just feel what has gone into the product and if you're thinking that that sounds strange as soon as you use a molten brown product whether it be a shower gel whether it be a, a, a fragrance a perfume um, a body spray a soap product um, many many products from molten brown which as you can probably tell I've tried a lot of them yes they're expensive and probably why I received them at Christmas and birthday and things is because they come in gift sets and they're the most amazing gift to receive. The smells are always true to life and it's really, really lovely. Um, and they're, of course, a little bit cheaper in a gift set. But if you buy the product on its own, that's what I'm going to touch on now. So conditioner, £20. And then the shampoo, £20. And the volumizing one, £20. So that's thickening. This is volumizing, which are both £20 each. So I know I have £60 worth of products here, but I actually got it as a gift. <laughs> but it is a really good product so if you do want to sort of treat yourself and you do want to sort of spend a little bit more and a little bit more investment for your hair i absolutely certainly urge you to give them a try now let's have a look at the thickening uh, shampoo first of all so thickening shampoo this is with ginger extract it's made in england and let's have a look on the back here so we have got hair looks fuller and the scalp feels energized with ginger extract the formula helps to restore healthy looking hair to leave it feeling thicker and thoroughly revitalized for fine hair usage use a small amount into hair and scalp then rinse thoroughly and this is for 300 mils and straight away the smell absolutely get ginger you don't get that overbearing ginger but it's certainly you do get the real natural tones there almost as though like you're cooking with ginger and it's a really lovely lovely uplifting smell it leaves the hair feeling thicker in the roots it leaves the hair feeling lifted and it certainly gives it much more texture and fullness and when my hair styled i certainly notice the difference in the roots i'm not going to say in the lengths because very often what i'm doing is i'm going through a stage now where i'm going to try and grow my hair out a little bit into a different of a longer style and i'll be covering that in a different clip but when i use this and i have used it once before actually when i do my pompadour looks it does give the hair almost much more texture and it gives the hair a little bit more of a scaffolding to start building the style what you're working with so this is perfect for that very often when you buy a thickening product i've used it and it's like not really done anything it's just my hair made my hair feel a bit coarse this doesn't do that it gives you that amazing sort of true to life fragrance really uplifting really really lovely in the morning if you're feeling a bit dicey or i always find using a ginger product is really quite stimulating really quite uplifting you can fill this on your scalp as well and it feels really, really nice to use now you're going to think how do i know this from only a small amount from the bottle i have used this about six times six times and i always say using it for about a week five days then i can get a fair representation of what it's like on my hair because very often I've bought a product before and I've used it once, then I thought absolutely amazing. I've gone to use it the following day and it's like, ah, that was enough. So I always like to try and give it a week. Most products, if it's for stimulating and it's for hair growth, then I will use it a lot longer. But for this, absolutely categorically for thicker feeling hair. And I want to just make that out there for thicker feeling hair, not terms of stopping hair loss. OK, because that's something very, very different thickening effects off of finer textured hair and of course you can use it if you've got thinning hair but I can't comment on whether or not that helps with thinning hair if you've got thinning hair then I would always suggest the first thing if you're noticing hair coming out the first thing to do is speak with a medical professional and that's coming from experience and I absolutely urge men and women watching this if you have a medical uh if you've got where you're noticing your hair is really really changing it's real dramatic change and it's really affecting you speak to a medical professional
So this, really, really love this and would absolutely recommend. I received it as a gift, so of course the cost is a little bit different for me, but if you wanted to really invest into something like this, it's 300 mils, and as I say, I've used this about six times, and it would just last and last and last, because you don't need to use a lot of it at all. It naturally lavers. When I say that, I mean, it, it doesn't feel like it's got all these nasty products in there. And I say nasty, sometimes we need those real stripping products to get rid of product um, and product buildup and things like that. This is just really nice. It's soft, it's gentle on the scalp, and it really does help you have that thicker feeling hair. Let's move on. So let's move on to the volumizing shampoo. Now, if I had a favorite, this would probably be mine, as you could tell. And I've used this probably, I've used it over about two to three weeks. So I've used this probably about twice as much as I've used this one. So you could probably say about maybe 10, 12 times. Um, and you may think that that's more than two weeks. Sometimes I wash my hair morning and night because I do have a lot of hair product in uh, a lot of the time. And sometimes if you're in the shower, it's just easier and it's just more refreshing too. And, and sometimes I get uh, vertigo and I get really quite off balanceness. So sometimes um, if I'm feeling a bit dicey, I like to use a bit more of a stimulating shampoo just because it makes me feel a bit more uplifted, a bit more healthier. Um, I know, silly tip, but for someone who suffered with vertigo and balance problems for quite a while, sometimes it's just easier for me to wash my hair that way um, when you're doing everything else in the shower. So this one is a volumizing one. I've got to try and get this correct and forgive me if I've not pronounced it right. I believe it's with Cumudu and then on the back here it's enriched with Cumudu fruit extract and amino acids. Hair is luxuriously volumized with boosted body, delicately fragranced with uplifted aromas of grapefruit, uh, magnolia and cedar for fine hair. Usage massage, on, massage into a small amount into the hair, scalp and rinse thoroughly. And this is for 300 mils as well. This straight away with terms of smell, so the other one had a real nice uplifting ginger smell. This is grapefruit. You can absolutely smell citrus in here straight away. Grapefruit. It's a really lovely. First thing in the morning, it's really, really nice. And again, if you're feeling a bit dicey, it's perfect for that as well. It's not rough. It doesn't make the hair feel coarse. It doesn't make the hair feel like cakey, like you've got something in your hair. It's same as with the thickening one. It doesn't do that either. It's really natural. It's really nice and well balanced on the scalp. And it just makes you feel like you've got that nice luxurious product. Of course, cost goes against it slightly, but if you can, and if you wanted to get this as a gift for somebody, men or woman, perfect. I can just imagine sort of a woman's longer hair, sort of fine, medium, thick, if you had that real nice sort of voluptuous rolls in the hair, that sort of retro look, that sort of uh, 1940s sort of rolls, wraps, that type of thing, would look absolutely glamorous and you could just imagine how really, really nice that look could look um, and really really pretty and then of course in men's hair that volumizing sort of effect for doing the pompadour even if you've just got a style like me I've been working quite busy today so if you just if you just want your hair to be straight just gives it a nice lot of volume in the roots okay so let's move on so on the back here I had a, what I wanted to pick up on was the amino acids. Now you may think, why is that? Amino acids is very, very good for sort of looking after the hair, sort of pushing vitality nourishment into the hair. Very often we get that in uh, skincare products, which gives us that nice comfortable feeling if we've got dry and irritated skin. So this is really, really great for sort of pushing that health, that vitality and that shine into the hair. So that's really, really great. And I can absolutely vouch that it certainly does that. It's great for creating volume in the hair. Not crazy amounts, but just enough so it feels really natural, really luxurious, and a real top-end fine product. Let's move on to the conditioner, and this is our last product. So this is £20, but this conditioner I absolutely love with both the thickening and the volumizing uh, shampoos. This is really, really nice for looking after the hair. Now, when I, I received this as a gift, I didn't have colour in my hair at all. And I looked at this and I thought, oh, I've read somewhere that it's for, perhaps I've made a mistake, nurturing, it's nurturing conditioner. And I naturally thought that that was for coloured. I thought it, my mistake, it's had for coloured hair on it. It does on the back. So when I read this, I thought to myself, oh, I haven't got coloured hair. So perhaps I'll put this back. I don't know what I'll be doing in the summer. Um, I might have a sort of a play around with my hair and see what's going on. But I liked it, really, really appreciative of it. And I thought, nice, I'll try this. Um, put it back. Of course, I've recently found it in the last couple of weeks. And this is Nurturing Conditioner. What a strange name you might think for conditioner, but if you use it, you'll know exactly what it feels like. So nurturing to me would be, uh, for example, isn't it? Nurturing to me is sort of wrapping around, caring, loving, sort of taking care of something, really pushing uh, vitality and youth into it. This is got it's saying here with Cloudberry. Don't know what that is, not going to absolutely proclaim that I do know what that is, but all I can say is that it absolutely feel, makes your hair feel absolutely amazing. So on the back here, enriched with Arctic 
cl uh, cloudberry extract, a UV filter, and rich conditioners. Hair is nourished, smooth, and radiant with a healthy looking shine. Delicately fragranced with the deep aromas of red fruits, I believe that's carnation, and pa pa I can never pronounce this one. Is it patchouli? <laughs> Forgive me if I've got that wrong, but it's for colour-treated hair. Usage, use a small amount into the hair after shampooing and rinse thoroughly. So I get a bit carried away with this, so it's about down here now. So I was like, because my hair's colour-treated with bleach, um, let's be honest, people say light-coloured hair, highlights. Let's be honest, if you're men and women, it's bleach. To be honest, I've got dark hair, as you can see. It's not natural, not going to proclaim it is at all. Um, however, we all get lightened hairs through using bleach. Can't really smarten that up, can you really? Um, but what I can say with bleached and highlighted hair and lightened hair is that it does need a lot of care. It needs a lot of moisture, and I've come to learn that uh, very sort of almost the hard way because my normal volumizing shampoo conditioner just does not work for me sometimes. It does, but then I find that I need a bit more nourishment, so I have to go looking for that oil-based product, that heat, the heat protectant spray, uh, leave-in conditioner sprays, that type of thing. So something for a color treat, uh, for color treated hair, absolutely amazing. And this, when you put this on your hair, I try and leave this on. So if I'm going in the bathroom. Um, and sort of one of my first things if I do that, then I will use a conditioner and then after the last thing I do in the bathroom, then I wash it off just to get that maximum nourishment in my hair. Because what this conditioner does is it really sort of, it lopes itself around the hair and it pumps that much moisture, conditioning into the hair. When you wash it off, it feels so new, that fresh haircut feeling which we all want, especially with highlighted hair as well because it can be quite drying. Um, a great looking colour, but my goodness, it takes a lot of looking after. Um, but certainly, if you can get the right products in this conditioner, I would certainly say absolutely amazing for colour treated hair. And when it says here, healthy looking shine, it certainly does that. It makes the hair smooth and it really sort of almost what I do find, and I can't guarantee this, but what I do find with this conditioner is it kind of looks after and gets rid of those yellowy tones. Now, I don't know if it is designed to do that, but I just find it makes the blonde tones in my hair much more pure. I don't know if you can tell with this light, but it just makes it much more pure. And because I've got a silvery tone of blonde in my hair, that's really difficult to keep. So this just really, really looks after my hair like that. And I suppose on the last note, for 300 mils, it lasts and lasts and lasts. You don't need to use loads, just like the volumizing shampoo and the thickening shampoo, a little goes a long way. And um, now for me, I usually use loads of product, but with this, because of the cost, I do tend to sort of tone it right down and I use a small amount. Um, and for me, it just looks after my hair and it's a product range which I absolutely love. And I would certainly recommend to anyone from right at the start of their sort of life of using hair as young children, all the way up to even around my nan's age, and she's mid, uh, she's coming in, she's 94, so um, yeah, absolutely, can't wait to see my nan again, and it would certainly be something which I would try with my nan's hair, because if anybody watches my channel, I look after her, she has Alzheimer's, and um, she's doing incredibly, incredibly well, um, and very often, between me and my mum, we look after her, and um, very often, if my mum's doing her hair or washing her hair, then I will help, um, and I will, uh, we, we try all different nice uh, sort of luxurious products and things, sometimes it's gifts, but sometimes just to look after her, and keep my nan looking as amazing as she would have wanted to. Um, that's just a little bit of personal history there on my note, that how we quite got onto that, but it's something I'm proud of. Very, very close to my family and my nan and my mum, as well as my dad and my brothers, of course. <laughs> um, but there we go. So I really, really hope you've enjoyed that clip. I absolutely love Molten Brown, if you didn't know that one, of course. Love their fragrances, I have to admit, and the new ranges for this Christmas 2020, I absolutely love, and hopefully I'll be receiving under the Christmas tree. Um, anyway, thank you very much indeed for watching my clip. I urge you to give them a try if you can, or if you're looking at a gift idea, possibly, and you've just come across this on YouTube, you've not come here for that, but you're thinking actually in the back of your mind, you're wondering what to get. If somebody loves their hair, and somebody loves trying hair, hair products, don't be judgmental. Men really like to do that as well, evidently. <laughs> um, it's, it's perfect. A gift like this is absolutely amazing. So there we go. Hope you helped you out. So in terms of, you're probably wondering what regular people, uh, regular people, regular subscribers on my channel, thank you very, very much for being here. You're probably wondering what's going on with my hair. Um, I'm going to do a bit of a separate clip about that at the moment, but I am sort of slowly growing it out. Number one, just to cover up the hearing aids. And just because I fancy a bit more of a different style, I have worn the pompadour looks, the sort of all the length on top with a real super, super zero, um, bold sort of shaved sides for so, so long now. I really, really fancy a different try I've been thinking as we've been in this second lockdown here in England. Um, and I really wanted to try something different. So that's going to be something I'm going to be discussing in one of my upcoming clips. And as we go into the Christmas season, 
as we're in December already, um, I really would like to try something different for all those sort of festive pictures and things. That makes me sound really, really vain, but I love family pictures and things of all the family getting together. And of course, now the government have come out and told us about our restrictions of what we can do over the festive time. Um, really, really looking forward to that. Um, so yeah. And finally, once again, thank you very much for being here. It means the world to me. And until next time, we will see you then. Bye-bye now. Thank you. Bye now.